Well, dressing up on Halloween to collect candy is one of the best things about being a kid or as an adult. In my <laughs> case, it's true. It's important to make sure their costumes don't get in the way of a good and a safe time. Here's NBC's Erica Edwards. Stormtroopers haven't always been known as the brightest stars in the galaxy. I will destroy them. Maybe it's because their armor made it difficult to see where they were going. I can't see a thing in this helmet. Inspired by the upcoming Star Wars movie, DIY websites are full of instructions on making Stormtrooper Halloween masks for kids. All you need are a few empty milk jugs, a Sharpie, maybe a glue gun. 800 easy steps later, you might get something that resembles this if you're lucky. But safety experts say it's just not worth the trouble. Masks impair vision, meaning trick-or-treaters may not see oncoming cars. Safe Kids Worldwide says that translates into a scary annual rise in kids killed in car accidents. On Halloween night, we see the number of fatalities actually double compared to any other night of the year. Drivers may not be able to see kids, especially if they're wearing costumes like this one called the Invisible Kid. It's a bodysuit that completely covers a child in black cloth, making them blend into the night. Thank you. The Consumer Product Safety Commission suggests giving glow sticks to kids in darker costumes. And also line the costumes with something like reflective tape, the costumes or their trick-or-treat bag. Keeping kids safe this Halloween is the best treat of all. And anyway... Oh! <laughs> Little stormtroopers may be cuter without their masks on. Oh my. <laughs> Erica Edwards, NBC News. Thank you, Erica. Well, safety experts also recommend making sure costumes fit well and they aren't too long to avoid trips and falls.